So like I was saying, the thief made off with a priceless treasure from that noble's mansion. I know, I know. Then he was caught and the loot was returned, right? No. See, that's just nobility trying to keep things quiet. The treasure in the mansion right now is... Ah, so that's why they only had a hundred gold instead of their millions and millions of gold. You're pulling my leg. Hey, you didn't hear it from me, Bob. The Dark Wings are going nuts looking for the hideout. You mean the Thieves' Guild? <clears throat> That's enough out of you. Almost mealtime. Yeah, fraternizing with the uh, hey, prisoners, man. You're awake, right? You gotta be getting tired from keeping so quiet. You think that little story up all by yourself, old man? You must have plenty of time on your hands. Old man? Now you've gone and hurt this old man's feelings. Besides, I didn't make up nothing. I've got eyes and ears the world over digging up information for me. <laughs> sure you do, old man. Hey, I am what I am. Go ahead and ask me something. I'll tell you whatever you want to know. Want to know about the Pirate Guild's sunken treasure? How about the sorcerer who makes his home at the ends of the earth? Or wait, I've got it. I just want to know how to get out of here. Well, I'm not sure what you're in for, but they'll let you out if you keep your trap shut for ten days. The lower quarter will be underwater by then. The lower quarter? Ah, oh, yeah, I heard about that. I wonder how they're all doing right now. Sorry, neighbor. That's one piece of dirt I don't have. And what am I gonna do about that damn Mordio? The Mordio? You mean to say you've got connections to the famed mage from Ospio, the City of Scholars? Well, do you know about him? Oh, wanna know, huh? I'm afraid that information won't come cheap. The famed mage from Ospio, the City of Scholars, right? I think I got it. Well, wait, that's not it. He's the, uh, the head of the Gourmet Guild. No, wait, it's the, uh, I mean... Yeah, you let your card show. Not supposed to do that, old man. Especially if you're uh, dealing in information brokerage. Oh well, just when things were getting good. Hurry up. What is Commandant Alexei doing here? Whoa! Oh. Just who are you anyway? What does the head of the knights want with you? Beneath the statue of the goddess. What are you doing? I said hurry up. All right, easy. I'm coming. I did say I was looking for a way out of here. Yay! All right. Back in jail. Back again. Man, I was just in here last month for fighting some knights collecting taxes. I guess I get free meals out of it, if you can call it food. Damn, Kimor has made this way more complicated than it needed to be. Yeah, screw Kimor. Would you look at that? It opened. You act so surprised. Why? You did get a key from an old man. Ever vigilant as usual. With the way he's sleeping, it'll be a while before anyone notices I'm gone. And if I come back before morning, they'll never be the wiser to my little jailbreak. I think I can check on the lower quarter and make it back by morning. It'd probably be good to try that statue of the goddess, too. And here's the save point, whatever. We already know about this. Anyway, guys, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different with this Let's Play. I'm just going to be continuing onward and doing stuff. Ooh, magic lens. Uh, and cut it, cut the parts in whatever, however much length it is, you know. And I think I'm going to be putting, putting them to like 23, 24 minutes. Especially since how long this game is. Let's see, what equipment do I have? Yeah, I don't really have anything as of right now. Just got my basic equipment back. Yay! Be very, very quiet. Who's there? Ah, they spotted me. Well, at least he's a little bit more quiet than uh, oh, man. Quark oh, is. Right. 
dude, if Quark was in this situation, what would he do? He'd go around and sit and bash in doors like none other. Ow, my face is an iron, and you have a magic lens. Night Fencer, level 5. Yay, get away from me, Night Lancer. Or Night Fencer. There's actually a Night uh, Lancer in here as well, so yeah. Good job, man. Excellent work. Uh, you're the only one in here, Gary. Why are you congratulating people? Yeah, my rap sheet is long enough as it is, but I guess I don't have much choice but to fight if they discover me. I need to be wary of these guys on patrol. Yay! And uh, we also get... It's a little different than uh, Tales of Eternia when you encounter battles in this one. Tales of Eternia, they actually had random battles, whereas in Tales of Vesperia and other Tales games, you, you can actually avoid battles. The only way that you can get into battles is by running into guys like us. So, oh, man. and this is the uh, light, Night Lancer. Hello, Night Lancer. Magic lends to you. Cool. These guys are actually a little bit more dangerous than the night fencers because they have a longer reach, but other than We're that, done. they still go down just as easily. No, not really. Anyway, cutscene coming up here. Yeah, the beginning of this game has tons of friggin' cutscenes. Uh, I mean, they're not as long as Star Ocean cutscenes, mind you, but hey cutscenes nonetheless why don't we just go back I can't go back now this is for your own good miss you know that as for the incident we assume full responsibility and will inform the lieutenant ourselves how can you say that when you haven't done anything to help me please don't come any closer now now why don't you put that down you'll only end up hurting yourself I know how to use a sword. I'm afraid you leave us no choice. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. Hey, there she is! This way! Please, you've got to let me go! I have to warn Flynn! Did she say Flynn? No, she said Superman. Hey! Of course she said Flynn! Uh, apparently not Flynn. But hey, Uriel do. Identify yourself. I'll identify myself by my blade. Death to all you who oppose me. Man, just when I thought I was being sneaky, things have to go to hell. Careful, I think he's gonna blast you. It shouldn't be a problem if we take him together. Yeah, screw you guys. This is what you get for taking on a poor defenseless girl. Even though she actually has a sword. Hey! He won't even let me. Hey! Quit hitting my face! Man, is this what knights do now? Apparently, pick on little girls. Don't they teach these guys manners in night school anymore? And throwing of the vase. Hey, are you trying to kill me? Well, you don't belong in the castle, right? No, and I'll take it as a compliment that you can tell that by looking at me. I say, we know you're trying to make your escape. Oh, please, not them again. I guess there's no point in going back to the prison cell now. Louder, fools. Say it like you mean it. Lieutenant LeBlanc, your voice is too loud. My ears. Yuri Lowell? You're one of Flynn's friends, aren't you? Yeah. Why? And you used to belong to the Imperial Knights. Just for three short months. You hear that from Flynn? Yes. Huh. Guess he managed to find someone at the castle he could talk to after all. Yuri, I need to talk to Flynn. Hold on just a second. Who are you supposed to be, anyway? I can tell you know Flynn, but why are you being chased by the knights? Over here! Listen, I want to hear the whole story, but we can't really afford to stand around and chat. First things first. Let's get to Flynn's place. Want me to lead the way? Uh, yes. Let's go. Alright, so apparently 
Yuri has his own background with the Knights. Yeah, whatever. Actually, I believe they go into it a little bit more with uh, disappearing knights. Actually, uh, the uh, Tales of Vesperia First Strike DVD thingy. Mmm, something smells tasty. Oh, you're right. What could it be? Oh, yeah. Isn't the Knights Dining Hall around here? Yay, yeah, and if you're low on health and TP, the technical points in order to use your special skills and stuff. You can actually come in here and uh, grab some Kiri. Not bad. Full health, full TP. I ain't complaining, especially for free. Hey, free heal. I'll take any day of the week. That's you. Yeah, I don't know Let's if I'll be going there. around and fighting all the battles in here, but... Yeah, whatever. Screw you! Die. That was easy. Yeah. If you actually know how to dodge attacks, these guys are actually really, really easy. And I fought you before, so therefore, yeah. You, you need to die because you're guarding a chest. Let's get I want to see with. what's in that chest and be like, hey, quit hitting me and stunning me. Man, I was just getting. Yeah, yeah, getting warmed up and all that fun jazz. Ooh, life bottle. That will come in handy once we actually get more people in our party. Good God. And yes, there are some things that are... The names are the same between each uh, Tales game, like, you know, the apple gel and the life bottle and all that. So, yeah, nothing too, too bad to scoff at. Yeah, I was around here. This is Flynn's room? And, yeah, this is Flynn's room. Uh, beware, guys. I, if you're not confident in your abilities, and you're playing along with me, grind up a level or two before you enter this room. Trust me, it'll be well worthwhile. But, you know what? I can do this. You can do it! He's really keeping this place cleaned up. And Flynn must be off gallivanting around somewhere. Then that means I'm too late. So, what sort of wickedness did you do anyway? Me? I haven't done anything. Yeah, wrong. that's what you say. And yet a bunch of knights were chasing you around the castle. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, you see, Yuri. Whoa. What is it? I can't be specific, but Flynn is in terrible danger. I've got to go and warn him. So, go if you want to go. What's wrong with that? I wish I knew. Listen, I've got something I've got to take care of right away, too. As soon as things quiet down outside, I want to get back to the lower quarter. In that case, would you take me with you, please? Other than Flynn, there's no one I can depend on. Will you at least help me get out of the castle? Please. I'm begging you. <sighs> okay, I can see you're serious, but why don't you tell me your name first? <laughs> Prepare to fall victim to my blade. Yeah, yeah, I hear you, but I don't care about you, dude. You got the wrong guy. Die. You really should listen a little more. My name is Saki. Remember it well, Flynn. Listen, I'm not Flynn. <laughs> oh, what's wrong? What the hell is wrong with you? I'm gonna kill you and carve your name into my blood. Yeah, that's pretty disgusting. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be fun! Alright, you guys. This is... Basically, the first boss fight, first major boss fight of the game, anyway, against Zoggy, aka Mr. Boner Man, because, well, you'll see in a moment. Anyway, magic lends him real quick 4,500. 
Yeah, we don't have to not knock him down all the way, but eh, whatever. Ow, freaking Reaper's Cross Cross hits my face and makes it painful. Oh, the pain and the hurt and the doom and the death and the... Ow. Yeah, this is why I said level up. Hey, don't kick me. Don't kick me. I didn't say you could kick me. I didn't say you can kick me. Why are you coming over here and kicking me? Why? Yay, guard break. Um, please. This first part, this first phase of him, he has two phases, by the way. This first phase of him is actually a little bit, it's a little bit more dangerous because Yuri's by himself. But uh, you feel what? I'm not feeling anything over here. Yes, so full of. Oh crap! It's growing. Yeah, he's just reaching the climax now. What's with him all of a sudden? He's getting a boner, Yuri. What needs to be said more? <laughs> Yuri, let me help you. Stay away. But bring it. The more the merrier. If things get out of hand, run for it. I will. Oh, don't give up so soon. I haven't had a fight like this in years. <laughs> this is fun! Relax! He's just doing that to mess up our fighting. You relax. Trust me, he's not thinking that hard. So, that's just who he is? The more you talk, the faster you die, Flynn. Damn it, I am not... Uh, never mind, you're not listening anyway. But if it's just a misunderstanding, maybe we can talk. <laughs> Your fate was sealed the moment we met. All right. I think that's the end of the conversation. You seriously think we could talk to him? Nope. Let's just take him out already. Oh, get away from the girl! Don't you dare go oh, after my healer. That hurts. Uh, yeah, there's a thing called a secret mission in this fight, the very first secret mission that you can do. Um, and it's basically, um, Estelle, uh, crap, whatever. Dang it, you don't have item thrower. Anyway, yeah, you just have to protect Estelle from getting uh, comboed like Yuri is. So if you get Zagi to focus on Yuri a lot, then you have no problem with doing it. I've never been able I have never been able to fail this mission. So come on. Do I look like Flynn to you? Not in the least. Anyway, if you want to look at the achievement, yeah, yeah, defeat Zagi while protecting Estelle's from Zagi attacks. I feel power running all through. You've got the wrong guy. Aren't you supposed to know this stuff? He's not Flynn. Details, details. Bring it. This guy's nuts. Flynn sure has made some interesting enemies. Zagi, we're leaving. The knights are on to us. Falcon Punch! How dare you! <laughs> Mind your own business! I'm just getting to the best part! Hurry, before the knights get here! Or would you rather have your fun end today? Silence, you! We should be getting a move on too. We'll just go pay a visit to the goddess and be on our way. Yuri, um... Yeah, I know. We'll stick together until we're out of the castle. Oh, right. But I was gonna say, my name is Esteliz. Well then, Esteliz, let's get moving. Wait, we can't just leave the door like that. I really don't think this is the time to worry about something like that. But... Fine. All right, all right. Just... just give me a minute. There. Good as new. Now let's get going. Uh... okay. Yuri, Mr. Handyman. 
Yeah, he fixes doors on it while he goes and kills off knights. But anyway, oh, Estelis won't be in our party for the uh, for the next little bit. We have to go and do something in order to get her in our party. But yeah, I got a little work. Yeah, yeah. And that's just basically getting to her room. Yeah. I wonder if this is because of those guys earlier. They better not try to pin this on me too. I hope no one was hurt. Don't worry about the knights. They'll make sure to protect themselves. Yes, I guess so. You're in all. Where are you hiding? That must be LeBlanc. I can't recognize those dulcet tones anywhere. Do the two of you know each other? We have a bit of a history. Come on, let's hurry. Yay. We should do something about your clothes. You stick out like a sore thumb. Yuri, you sly dog, you. My room is just up ahead. I have a change of clothes there. Okay, that'll work. You meet the first girl, pretty girl you meet, you want to get her out of her clothes and into her bedroom. Eh, uh, whatever. I don't care. This is my room. I'll go get changed. Just give me a minute. Got it. Try to be quick about it. Just in case. It's not like I was going to peek. Yeah, you were going to do something else, but... Yeah, she's... Right, she's correct at taking the sword in with her. Flynn did tell me to be careful if I ever met you. Thanks, Flynn. Hey, Flynn was just looking out for Estelle. Come on. There, all finished. What? Do, do I look and strange? that's not any more sticking out like a sore thumb than the last dress you were wearing? It's nothing. I was just thinking this doesn't suit you either. Really? What's this? A handshake. It means nice to meet you. All right, let's get going. Thanks. Yay, our first party member.